What's going on guys, it's like, okay, k here from Frisbrook Productions. Today I'm going to show you how to install Sony Vegas Pro 11 without, with the downloads in the description, no surveys, none of that bullshit. It's completely, everything is going to be there, and this is completely legit, not any of that stupid crap that people just try to make money off of. Okay, so first off, um, this is for Sony Vegas Pro 11, as I just said, and not for Sony Vegas Pro 12, I don't have key gen for that yet but as soon as I get one I will put it a video out and I will have an ad annotation to it right now so let's get started first off you, in the description you're gonna want to figure out which version you have is Sony Vegas Pro 13 32 bit or 64 bit the way you can find that is hit the start menu computer right click on it click properties and then right here you'll see what version you have once you do that you're gonna want to download the correct version in my case, I already I'm 64-bit, but I already have 64-bit installed. As you can see, I'm editing a video right now, or rendering it, I should say. And so I'm gonna install 32-bit. You're gonna double-click on it, let it open, click yes, click your language, click next. Um, it's all the current version. I've read, and blah blah, blah you know, whatever. Um, change this whatever you want. Just remember where you should save it to. Create a shortcut on the desktop whether that's if you want an icon or not choose whatever you want install let it install give it a couple seconds shouldn't take that long any minute shouldn't take this long, but sometimes it's a little slow. It's taking me longer than it should because I'm rendering a video and I have Steam open, I have tons of stuff open, which I should have probably closed all those things. Okay, installed successfully. Whatever you do, do not open this yet. If you do, you're gonna have to uninstall it and then reinstall it. We're gonna click on Vegas patch, click yes. Now there is gonna be some loud music, so if you don't want it, click right click on it, click open volume mis m m mixer on this and click the mute button so yeah want to click this and we'll scroll down to receive Vegas Pro 11 make sure you click 32 bit or 64 bit whichever one you downloaded 32 bit patch if you didn't change where the location is then you're just gonna want to go to program files times 86 and if you're doing 64 bit you want to just go through program files click on where is it Sony Vegas Pro 11. Now you're just going to want to do that again because now it's just doing a different directory. And scroll down. Past it. Okay. Sony Vegas Pro 11. Click OK. And it's just going to patch. Just let it do its thing. It sh shouldn't. Sh sh should. Blah. Should take about two minutes. Two to th five minutes. Shouldn't take that long. Depends on how fast your computer is. And it should say file has patched successfully. Okay, you want to keep this open. Don't do anything with it yet. I want to go to all programs, scroll down until you see, let's see, Sony, whatever version you have, it should say 64-bit or normal, if you don't have both of them installed, then I think it might just say 11, so click on it, next, yes, and you're going to want to put in the serial key that you have right here, so just hit control Z, it's control, not control, control C, and you want to hit control V, click next, register later next now if you don't click use this version it I don't know it might not work because if you click on install new version I had a bug where it wasn't wanting to register online and it didn't, didn't give you the register later thing so and when I tried to register it online it wouldn't work it couldn't reach the server for some reason so it might not have it with you then just install the newer version now it's gonna want the authentication code you're gonna click down here make sure you highlight the whole thing control C I click, I click control B, but control C, control V, click next, and there you go, you should be in. Now I can just exit this, make sure it's doing its thing, just give it a second, and if you've done this correctly, hopefully it will open now, and you should be good. And then just make sure that it cracked correctly, hit exit out, and it shouldn't say, oh, your trial is entered by now, whatever. So I hope you guys this helped you out a lot and 
let me know guys if there's a new patch that you find or if, if you need it if there's any problems just let me know leave a comment below or send me a message don't for, uh, don't forget to like favorite and subscribe also if you're looking for a good tech server my website for it is feserver.net I'll also be in the description so peace out